Welcome back to the Excel lecture. Today I'm going to discuss uh, the population and sample in chapter 1. What is population? It is a whole set of data which we are interested in. Well, in case of uh, a country, we are curious about uh, how many persons are there and uh, what they think like that. If the, the size of the country is getting big, well, nowadays, the, like China, India is more than billion person, it is not easy to check what they think, mean how they live. Therefore, there is a natural motivation. We collect just a small sample, try to estimate that. In the sense, the like uh, China, India, the big number of data, we call this is population. If you collect a small sample, well, we call that is a sample. The modern statistic, I mean, maybe the most interesting thing in modern statistic is to try to estimate population characteristic with a small sample. For example, in case of uh, the presidential election in the United States, uh, there are more than 200 million voters. In order to know that, what percentage of a person would prefer a certain candidate, uh, they collect just 1,000 samples. Uh, that's the power of modern statistics based on population and sample relationship. We call, if you have some data, if you, it can be a population data, sample data, if you try to just describe the population or sample, we call that is a descriptive statistic. In this book, we are dealing with that topic in, from chapter 2 to 5. Data visualization, data summary, and by looking the data, what would be appropriate probability model like that? The main topic, the modern statistic is the inferential statistic. We'll discuss from chapter six to the rest of the chapter. We'll discuss the sampling distribution, estimation, testing hypothesis, and then regression analysis. Here's an uh, example of, uh, I mean, two examples. Suppose these are the voting results for the 2016 United States presidential election. It look like this, okay? Uh, Donald Trump got this amount of vote. Maybe Hillary Clinton got more vote, but for the electoral vote, well, Donald Trump got 304, but Clinton got only 227. Uh, this is total result of voting result. Therefore, it is uh, some population data. It's a summary table of population data. Instead, uh, this example says the CNN poll was conducted uh, during this period. They say Donald Trump got 46% and Joe Biden is 51%. But at that time, they collect just a sample of 1,001. Then this is the sample data. By using this, we are going to in for estimate the population characteristic. In this case, uh, population percentage who prefer the, this candidate. Well, in detail, this textbook from chapter two to five, it is related with uh, just uh, data summary visualization. 
We call this is a descriptive statistic. We describe both population and sample. But from chapter 6, we discuss the relationship between sample and population. And we discuss estimation, testing hypothesis, and some other topics. Okay, these are the population and sample. Those two are very important terminology. You should remember that. 